So in this video, we're gonna be going over six style hacks that we can use in our everyday life. If that sounds interesting to you, let's get into it. What, the first hack I'm gonna teach you is making sure your pants fit without trying them on. And there's two ways to go about that. So what I have here is just a pair of jeans that I own here. What you can do to see if your pants will fit is using your forearm. So typically your waist is about the same width as your fist all the way down to your elbow. You go down and you can measure and kind of see. It's pretty cool, right? And what you can do is you can take the inside of your pants and you can take this fist and you can stick it inside and you can go to your elbow, right? And if it fits like this, then your pants will fit around your waist. Another way of seeing if your pants will fit around your waist is if you can take your pants and you can wrap it around your neck. If they touch right here ever so slightly, then your pants will fit. So that's the first hack. Second hack I'm gonna teach you is using a paper clip to keep your collar straight. Most button down shirts come with collar stays. Collar stays are these little plastic things that come right here underneath your collar of your button down shirt. See this right here? I'll show you right here. In the event that you don't find yourself with one of these collar stays for your shirt, what you can use is a paper clip. You unfold it and you just shove it right up in there and then bam, it serves the same exact purpose of a collar stay. Please make sure before you wash that shirt that you remember to take out that paper clip out of your shirt. The third hack I'm going to teach you is how to keep your zipper up using a key ring. We've all experienced this before where we had a pair of pants that we zipped up or just wouldn't stay up and it was always coming down. Well, what I'm going to teach you is using a key ring, how to keep your zipper up at all times. And it is 100% fail safe, right? So the first thing you're going to do is that you're going to attach the key ring through that loop or that hole in your zipper. You're just going to zip your pants all the way up. You're gonna put that key ring right there on that button, and then you're just gonna fasten your pants right there. Simple as that. The fourth hack I'm gonna teach you is how to deal with excess fabric when you're tucking in your shirt inside of your pants. We've both had a shirt where we've tucked in our shirt and we had that excess fabric just kind of hanging out. What I'm gonna show you is a little simple trick called the military tuck to where it's gonna give you that nice smooth aesthetic that you want to give off the impression that your clothes actually does fit closely to you. All right, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna take that excess fabric, you're gonna take it, you're gonna fold it behind you, and then you're gonna tuck your shirt right into your pants, and then voila, no more excess fabric. It looks like that you have a very slim fitted shirt. That is something that you can use until one day you can hopefully get to a tailor so that you can actually get your shirt to fit the exact way that you want to. Fifth hack I wanted to show you is how to tie a knot on your shoe to where it doesn't come undone. And also, you have a straight tie going across the top of your shoe. Oftentimes when we tie our shoes, when we tie it, we do the bunny ear thing, and I'm gonna do this right here off the top of my head. We're gonna do that thing to where you, you grab the loop, you tie it, and you go across the top, and then when you tie that knot, boom, it comes off, you know what I'm saying, crooked. But then oftentimes when you kind of go out the course of your day, you find yourself have to retie that shoe, right? Well, I'm gonna show you a different way to tie your shoes because you've been tying it wrong your entire life to where you'll get a straight tie across your shoe. And then also that knot is even more tighter than the previous knot that I just described. So for this one, you're gonna do the same exact thing, this step, except for when you're going across the top to loop it through, you're gonna go underneath. So when you go underneath, and then you pull it through and tie that knot, you're gonna get that straight knot right across the top of your shoe, and it is also very, very tight. Very, very simple. If you have been enjoying everything that you've been seeing so far on this video, then please do me a favor, hit that bell icon so that you can join the notification squad every time that I drop a video with content just like this. And this sixth and final hack I'm gonna show you is how to taper your pants without having to go to the tailor. It's very, very simple. So what you're gonna do is, is that you're just gonna grab the excess fabric that's sitting there right around your ankle. You're gonna take that and you're gonna fold it back and then you're gonna cuff it no less than two times so that that cuff can hold and that taper can stay. And you'll see that that works really well with low top shoes and then high top shoes. So thank you all for tuning into this video today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed what I was able to teach you guys. 
and hopefully you're able to use them. If you feel as though there are other style hacks that can be used, please comment below. In the meantime, thank you. Oscar, signing out. Mic drop.